all right i'm out here getting hiking gonna be exploring a new trail i'm gonna be going on the espinoza trail seeing what there is to offer out here it's a pretty strenuous uphill terrain so we'll see how challenging it is it's on the it's a hike i've been wanting to do for a while now but i haven't had the guts to try it out so we'll see how it is today made it back to my usual spot. There is so much water here. It looks like I'm gonna be taking off my shoes to cross the river today. Never had to do that. It's just absurd how much water is here right now. Should be really interesting. I'm gonna be hiking in some uncharted areas, so wow, look at this. Shoes are off. That's good. That's good. made it across the river. Now we're hiking on to uncharted territories. It's freaking lush out here. Right, the trail is officially just straight up. Absolute ass kicker. All right, I'm still pushing. I've contemplated turning back many times. I just keep thinking I already committed this much, might as well just keep going. So I'm gonna see what's up around this hill. Maybe we'll turn back after this hill. But it's pretty brutal. Very pretty views. No sign of any deer or anything yet, no tracks, but definitely very remote, which is pretty cool. So we'll keep on trucking and see where we end up. All right, so mountain range on the left is the Corte Madre. Mountain on the right is the Los Pinos Mountain, which I've explored before in my game warden video. Got some berries on the Manzanita tree. And just overall, very strenuous, but beautiful hike. All right, you can see the trail on the left here. It kind of winds up and it goes down below the base of the Corte Madre. And you can see it weaves up to the very top and that's where it will intersect with the road up there. Pretty cool. I think this is where I'm gonna turn around. Maybe in another video, I'll come on the road with the off-road vehicle. Sadly, my Subaru can't make it, but maybe take an off-road vehicle and drive up to that path and then hike down from up there. On my way back down, I did run into this little baby lizard as well. Overall, this hike was seven miles in distance round trip. It was about a 1,700 feet elevation gain of ascent and 1,700 feet descent. 
I'd recommend this hike for anyone looking for a workout and an uphill climb. As you ascend the mountains, there's beautiful views of the surrounding mountains and hills. This hike took me three hours to complete. From the bottom water hole, I spent about an hour and 10 minutes up to my furthest point up the mountain. Going down the mountain only took me about 36 minutes to get back down. Gonna take a little rest and let my feet dry before heading back up the hill. Pretty good day so far. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like and subscribe to the channel.